Okay, Berserk one, chapters 126 to 130. <coughs> the people saw it in their sleep. Conviction arc, birth ceremony, chapter, revelations, part 1, 2. What is this? There was a kingdom of villages dying out from plague, routed by an army, driving mammoth beasts. There was a city devastated by earthquake towns swallowed by raging torrents. There was a sun obscured by black smoke and mobs of starving vagrant folk. There were the corpses of both family and neighbor. Each event occurred individually yet converged upon one idea. Each night an utter darkness fully enveloped, with, enveloped their world. What is this? Then amidst such such discord, they caught sight of it. A single shining hawk, sundering the thick darkness alighting upon the blood-stained land. They believed in the instinct instinctively this was their desired desired. It's past tense, not desired. Western Midland What a dreadful sight <coughs> During times of war The stone and lumber It feels like I've seen this guy before Is this, Isn't this the The knight from the Midland Kingdom Who Somewhat Like also one of the Infamous, um, like general similar to uh, Band of the Hawk. So maybe this is. It feels like it, this is after the eclipse. I don't know say. During times of war, the stone and lumber in this area was cut and quarried and massed to build forts and the like. All that remains are bare mountains, but still this rain. I do look forward to some strong drink in at the inn this evening, Lord Laban. Hey. <coughs> that was rash of me. Please forgive me, oh God. Whatever the case, why this large crowd? I do not know. They seem to be coming from the town ahead. Damn. Is that a landslide? Yeah, it's a landslide. The ground was loosened by the rain. All forces hold. All, all security forces dismount. Rescue our, our subjects. Follow me. So maybe, yeah, I feel it feels like we've seen this guy before. And it seem, he was, I think, one of the only generals who was like somewhat um, supportive of who has also has a respect towards Griffith compared to the other older generals who think lightly of what Griffith, Griffith, who Griffith was and with his plan. Yeah, I feel like we've seen him during the siege of like the castle um, when they uh, when they fought the the Rhino Knight or something. Heavens, Your Excellency, for mere peasants to personally Excellency. Ah, very well then. Hop to it. Follow General Laban. So this is definitely might be the current situation now in Midland, especially after what happened. Hey, hang on. There, you're safe now. What in Adjutant, take care of the m of this mess. Should you finish the work before I return, have all forces stand by and keep the pe and keep the peasants here too. Meaning what, Excellency? Where are I'll soon re I'll return soon. Put the wounded in the covered wagon, and treat the peasants to something warm. Excellency, I'm borrowing this. Don't tell me this is. Oh, is this the Count's place? 
or is this the um, the place of why wild so that's the only things left damn oh it's a famine damn they just died of hunger oh no a plague the plague then as i feared get get confounded rats now that their food supply is swollen they've got big big and fat they come from the devil they done brought this plague here damn since these rats started growing in numbers so much that the plague spread through this town grim little li reapers well i say that but they came to the town because people left the hills bug and took away their food and homes mayhaps we reap what we sow man this is <laughs> this is still going on aside from the fact that <laughs> the apostles and the monsters are, are also killing them so this is just like natural disasters happening at the same time yeah, this is such a brutal world and uh, I th yeah this is this is definitely one of the problems during the the medieval times is yeah plagues famine and yeah sometimes it's just it, because sometimes the especially if the the, le the leaders or the lords are or the kings are, are gre really greedy they're not they're not prepared in such situations so it's definitely the people that will suffer you won't leave that town old one I don't care to desert this town at my age. My whole family is dead anyways. You'd best be off now before death hunts you too, Sir Knight. Waving your sword around will do no good in these parts. Yeah, but all don't seem tough for him not to be infected by the plague. It isn't just this town. I've seen the, I've seen the same kind of spectacle throughout the kingdom. Plague famine mercenary bands turned rubbers yeah there's there's that as well <laughs> such a dark shadow now covers all of midland no it's not just limited to this kingdom it's so it's all over i guess the world now is this the price of a hundred years of war it's a it's vexing a time like this is precisely when the entire kingdom efforts must be devoted to rebuilding yet our set yet over seven tenths of the military have spent two years searching for a criminal we're not certain still even still lives man the king is still hunting for yeah yeah i guess he's so obsessed with griffith especially i guess um yeah he was just he is crazy the state his majesty is in what is it what on her earth happened that day two years ago and i'm surprised he's still alive I guess it's it isn't that long yet it's only two years those eyes surely they are a madman's man this 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 um laban is much more suited to be a king rather than this old man, man. alas the search has exceeded its purpose but this kingdom wide desolation is a fact to say this crisis will decide our, all our fates is no exaggeration so this is i guess this is like his um his like his point of view he, how he sees the current situation now this is his like like um a representation of what the current situation is now a darkness that covers the world i suppose that was a revelation so i guess maybe it was like a vision that he saw or maybe a dream if it was then the hawk of light Man. <laughs> yeah you just made that hawk of light into the hawk of darkness uh, but i'm assuming this hawk of light is uh guts it's representing guts now because he's the only hope because the, the famine the plague now 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 during this time now uh it's only the minor things now <laughs> they have the they have to worry about the bigger ones now the monsters the apostles which is like man it's 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 more than just a nat natural disasters now it's it's 
it's it's it's definitely going to kill more than what the plague or maybe it's close but i feel like the plague or famine could be somewhat still um prevented or yeah something like that or because yeah maybe if you if you focus on dealing with uh maybe health issues you could prevent it from happening and or maybe just stop it from spreading but man the, the monsters i don't think um the humans have a way of dealing with them except for the only one right now which is guts if the dream is a revelation what does that part signify to me at least what a hawk symbolizes now for all the people of midland there's but one and no other it may be absurd but when you think of such of of it such even this search that seems meaningless excellency can be seen to possess some sense of purpose so you've come adjutant as you see we we must also blockade this town at once you don't look well but it's no surprise under these cir circumstances you just excellency i have had my feel of seeing people drop from the plague however however th that is it is another story for the head of our kingdom say what a message rider just came from Windham. Oh, his royal majesty has come to illness. It's all <laughs> it's now it's now going back to him. Finally. At the same time it would make him more um desperate for looking for Griffith, but it's too late now. Right, we must regroup. Tell me the details along the way. I Damn, man, look at those rats. Oh, it's not just the rats. It's an abo. Oh, man. Makes sense. It's like a combination. <laughs> man, it's one of the apostles. Or maybe just another monster. Oh, God. Damn. I hope Laban feels like Laban is going to play a bigger role especially I guess maybe uh, with that vision and, and I think that's maybe that it feels like that they're setting that up for him man what is this a hawk crucified and then the belly oh I, I, I remember now I think we saw this um with uh Yeah, the the Holy Iron Chain Knights arc. Conviction arc, birth ceremony, chapter. Revelations, part 2. Windham Castle. I wonder how the princess is doing. I wonder if she's pregnant too, because... Her and Griffith... Um, yeah, I think... I think they've had sex multiple times. Or was it only a one one time thing, but I think it's possible. But I guess we'll see. It's already two years. Charlotte. Charlotte. Kurt Doctor, please hurry. Summon his skin. At long last it is upon us the birth of a new queen. Her Majesty Queen Charlotte's. But consider her disposition, there, there is hardly a chance she will not appoint a regent. Then those in candidacy here are the, hold, then those in candidacy, candidacy are Home Minister Gustav, fin, Financial Minister Hugo, perhaps even Royal Household Protocol Ch Chief Cariel. We must consider our plans for the future. What about former Home Minister Foss? In the few years since the Queen's assassination incident, the Honorable Foss has not fallen under any faction, as if he has feigned retirement. Every rumor says that this mediator of the former conservatives has seemingly become disposed, dispossessed of his power. Yeah, especially after <laughs> um, Griffith burning the Queen and the others. 
yeah he definitely he's traumatized of what happened good grief they move keenly even before the sun finishes setting or perhaps i should say resolutely don't they understand what situation our kingdom is now in placed in they're also busy with self-preservation schemes when you can go several leagues from them and then in the dead lion piles no even here below this castle hmm are the deaths of subjects nothing more than statistics the hawk the hawk will come again the hawk that wondrous dream everyone in windham no perhaps everyone in midland saw the wondrous dream of the hawk of life oh it's not just laban man but <laughs> i wonder man, I, I don't think it has griffith though because <laughs> if, if griffith if Griffith comes back here, he might, he might. I guess the 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 king is now suffering. I guess he's, he's in his last moments. The priests clamored that it was God's revelation. They said it was a good omen, signifying the appearance of one who will save people from every calamity now, wielding its menace. But His Majesty's falling ill happened. After the people began to talk of the dream. Oh. Not that one such as I could truly comprehend the will of God. What if Griffith sent that vision? Is he, is he planning to, <laughs> to rule over Midland? But I don't think he cares about that anymore. It's a strange thought. But that... that but that that dream happened is the only unmistakable reality. A miracle has surely occurred. Your Highness, please open this door. What is the matter, Lord Lord Owen? You see, the princess has confined herself in her chambers for a whole five days now. Even before that, she had not set one foot outside the palace in the past two years. She would only allow one person in her favorite handmaid. We are presently trying to persuade her but your highness oh yeah highness i guess yeah she's she's not she was not pregnant pardon me uh, yeah i guess it's been it's been a year griffith was tortured for a year so yeah i guess it's yeah she she wasn't this girl a single timid girl is made bare it's made to bear the burden of everything. Reporting, Your Highness, a carriage has been prepared. Pl please hurry and come to the inner sanctuary. His Majesty on the verge of death. He mumbles Your Highness' name, name in. Hi Highness, no. Such a man isn't my father or anything. Hurry up, hurry, hurry up and get it over with. Don't keep this torture going forever. Don't torment me anymore. It's cold, almost as if I'm freezing. The king on his throne. Magnificent castle walls, but I cannot defend against the cold this way. Stone walls merely align. A ligament. A ligament the cold. Someone light a fire. On his throne. The king on his throne. Oh, valiant soldiers. With this man and this walls, my castle shall not waver. But for but for now, a fire. I shall freeze to death at this rate. Oh, maybe this is he's dreaming about this. Enough already. I have no need of soldiers now. Fire, someone bring fire. Bring warmth. I am anything. Is that? Oh, that's it. What I wish for, warmth. On his throne, the king on his throne. What are you doing? What are you doing? Move, move aside. My desire is. Oh. Oh, damn. Is this Griffith? What? A hawk, a hawk. Stop that. Get away. That's my precious. Get away. She's the king's life. My precious. <laughs> Yes, perhaps it is so. Perhaps I sought after, after you, as a rescuer to liberate me. On his throne, a solitary man from this prison called 
a throne to madness the king on his throne father yeah he's dead highness no no save me lord griffith Ooh. at a time like this his majesty has passed after so long what's going to happen to windham now and to midland the mountains are moving Ooh. enemy so it's like an, uh, their enemy yeah man they're <laughs> as the king dies and they have to p how come they've not scout this this is a massive army i think they could have they should they should have been able to detect that there's an army upcoming to attack them and by the looks of the of this it seems like like a representation of persia with the elephant the armor 128 no way just one man against a band of 300 mercenaries uh, uh, unbelievable i knew it i knew we shouldn't have taken this guy on what is happening blame the boss he was so hung up on getting famous the legend was real he's the god of the battlefield the immortal zod oh damn so i guess he's still working as a mercenary aside from as i guess that's his per <laughs> his pastime just how many times have i scored battlefield sitting on piles of corpses that i've made wandering for 300 years i guess seeking among man really is useless i've stood before the apostles so many times but somehow they're no good they cannot satisfy me there really are none but you wretch oh, the skull king oh yes that man the branded swordsman the rumors says the rumors say he's cut down several apostles he must now be somewhere creeping about in the night in any event in any event my discharge is just one thing oh what is this hawk i guess this is griffith now what's this but wait well, it's like this is within your dozing the dusk between dream and consciousness your you mean why what you sought were not words immortal definitely i seek only one thing the straw <laughs> only the absolute straw so i guess yeah maybe this is like griffith that his what he's doing now Oh damn, he cut off Zod's horn. Dream. No, damn. Was that a dream then? Damn. What is happening? When the sky falls at the holy ground where bond sheep gather and erect a pillar of fire. Yeah, it feels like this is definitely Griffith. And maybe this is now what he wants. It will come. The desired will come. The desired. So I guess the desired is like a, 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 a title. Or like a name of something. So that's why they, they, what the Laban was, I guess, from the beginning of this chapters. So I guess he's trying to look like the hope of the world now. Makes sense to he could do that now that he's the god one of the god hand. It's like he's going he's going to be like a savior to the world, but contrast to that, he's he's not. But I, I, I thought that he doesn't care about that anymore. I thought that he's like he he has somewhat changed now, but I guess he did rape 
um, Casca in front of Guts if he's still if he's somewhat changed a different person and he doesn't care about Guts anymore he's not feeling jealous about Guts anymore he doesn't want he doesn't care about Guts anymore he wouldn't do that so maybe this is really Griffith trying to fulfill his his um, his wish and now maybe he wants to become like the king the new king and yeah no good this place the same every house empty there's no food or anything left and the church is filled with dead bodies thanks to the plague every place looks the same inside they're swarming with specters now i can't even get decent sleep in the daytime why don't you go rest on that hill you ain't slept in two days now the ancient used that place to enshrine elves so the incubi shouldn't like it enough to come near probably it's like a hedge hedge stone or something Ooh, what, this is the the hawk the crucified hawk the behemoth what the oh they go they're burning a girl maybe there is she suspected this uh oh is that casca it is casca what the hell oh maybe this is the dream stop 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 oh it's his dream did the incubi do that oh his son you did it just now danger what are you trying to pull danger hurry when the sky falls at the holy ground blind sheep gather and erect a pillar of fire hurry quickly oh is Casca in danger oh that's why that's what she's telling guts probably but how far is guts to the to the mountains Hold on, no. Did something happen to her? Damn. What is with that dreams? Those dreams. Snow. Snow falls, snow falls. Win Spirit of winter, gently from the sky. Spirit of winter. It falls down like fluff. It dances lightly down. They try to catch it, see how wonders <laughs> blowing lots of bubbles, spirit of winter. Yes, yes, I caught something neat. They curd Oh <laughs> a chestnut head, head goblin. So I I guess they have now fought gone back. This is quite fast. Yo. You got a bit taller, didn't you? Oh, Rickert. Yeah, he's a blacksmith now. Rickert. Man, it's been two years. Welcome home, Erika. Good work. Thanks. You look a lot stronger. Didn't recognize you. Guts. Guts, you're alive. No word from you in two years. Where in the world and why? Sorry, Rickert. Before that, is she... Is Casca safe? What's wrong? Casca's... Casca's not here what what's that mean what's that supposed to mean Rickert guts why not since when where the hell oh that's him oh damn she got away oh damn that's the worst case scenario for two years <laughs> how long has she, has she been out I did it's my fault it's because I went and took her outside. Oh no, <laughs> Erika. Well, it's been a month. But still, she's branded. <laughs> it happened about a month ago. Casca had lived in the cave for so long she was pretty sick of it. And I'm assuming she's still somewhat out of it. Lately she'd gotten where she wouldn't eat even eat much. Erika couldn't stand seeing it, so she took her along to go pick fruit. Before I knew it, she was gone. I looked for her until the sun went down, but I couldn't find her. But Rickert, what are you doing here? 
you know full well how Casca is now and yet here you are why aren't you looking out for her stupid god stupid 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 what's the big idea what about you what you did you went and left her here and then you went off somewhere for two years you don't even know how Rickard feels he did go look for her again and again this past month month he went to look for her as much as he could but Rickard came back to us he came back home to us oh, so he just recently came back as well there's a reason I can't leave the old man oh he's also sick too much noise I can't even sleep Kodo wipe that stupid look off your face I here you can throw a rock without hitting a dead body down here there so what's so weird about seeing a half dead old man or two plague nothing so special as all that it's just old age old age just when I thought I'd have a quiet and peaceful death the noisy idiot <laughs> had to come back well you get to be here at my death I guess God's being nice to you so enough of the long winded speech let me see the sword and hand yeah it's so, so um I, yeah if it's like it, it needs like sharpening again Damn, yeah, is he going to get, have an upgrade? <laughs> Blade Nyx Blood Rust Bend shouldn't be this way even after 10 years. He's gonna take more than just a little elbow grease. You make you really make a blacksmith cry, you know that. <laughs> but yeah, he's, he's been fighting monsters. I'm guessing you swing and shoot too often to eat or sleep. You can't stay sane forever fighting that way. Yeah, he doesn't look sane anymore. Hey, your face looks even more tense than now than it did before. So if you didn't hate that much, you wouldn't even be able to stand up. Two years ago, when Ricard told in here, with the two of you busted up, I don't know what it was that happened to you all. Afterwards, when that monster came calling, I guess I had some clue what it could have been. So you're waging war against things like that. I can't even say for sure that it's the right thing to do. But worse, you do it for retaliation, for revenge. Listen, why not run away from war, from hatred? What? Listen, just listen. It's the rumblings of a dying old man. The thing about hatred. It's a place where people who can't look sorrow in the eye without wavering run off to. Even more than a blood-rusted sword, vengeance, vengeance is something you soak and sharpen in blood. You sink the blade called your heart deep into the blood in order to fix the nicks called sorrow. Damn! <laughs> yeah, that's really cool. You sink the blade called your heart. The more you sharpen it, the more it rusts. So you sharpen it again. In the end, all that's left is a pile of rust and scraps. Uh, come on, it ain't like you the lecture. You telling me to become a blacksmith or something? I wouldn't blame you if you wanted to. You've got some huge nicks in your heart. Damn cracks called fear running all through it. Man, this is so guts. But yeah, I don't think it's it's going to stop guts. At the same time, yeah, I think the the world need, <laughs> the world needs guts right now to at least lessen the the apostles, the monsters, cause yeah. The, the 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 human population will will like will might might be extinct you don't understand in this cozy place you're about to die with nothing left behind to regret you don't get it no one no human understands that they died no one was left not none of it made any sense suddenly and fairly like bugs without understanding anything but yeah pretty understandable i guess the old man has no idea um what happened at the same time yeah vengeance is somewhat destroying himself as well um towards that goal he's not even close man <laughs> that's the the crazy part is he's not even near or close to that objective of killing griffith 
they were all young they could have done something if they lived but still in an instant to me they were irreplaceable you abandoned those irreplaceable things you went alone on that day two years ago in your hopeless suffering you left the last irrep- yeah man you did it again Tell. <laughs> yeah makes sense he did it again Man, I just realized that he left Griffith. I guess he left the band of talks the first time. And he left Casca again. Man. Oh, man. That's. Uh, that's true, though. On that day, there, in your hopeless suffering, you left the last irreplaceable things you had and went away by yourself. You were right beside those irreplaceable. Man, this is like, <laughs> like a history repeating itself. Man. I hope Guts realizes it now. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. Why did he have to leave Casca? But yeah, I guess the the hatred was so... It's so stronger than... At the same time, he felt like he was... He wasn't able to do anything. Like, he, I think he thought that him staying here... It wouldn't change the situation with Casca. So maybe that's why he ought to, to focus on yeah finding this killing all the apostles and um finding Griffith, which this is somewhat so similar to what Eren has become. And yeah, or is yet you couldn't bear to immerse yourself together. In sorrow with them. And so instead. Man, but this. <laughs> the old man, man. He's, he's, he's dropping facts in the same time. Yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely going to make cuts. Hopefully. But if it's like he's already too deep. And I don't know. You, sh- you run away so that your own malice could burn inside you. Am I wrong? you have any place criticizing Rickert who l- you left here? Do you have any place talking about revenge for your friends when you're the one who went off abandoning that girl here? At the critical moment, you go and choose yourself and rely on fighting. You're like a drawn son, the sword in the battlefield. Yeah, it's the only thing he knows what to do. One with countless snakes soaked in blood and rusting. With a little crack in it, a sword that's beginning to break. Damn, man. <laughs> that was heavy for Guts. But I think he needed to hear it. And... Damn. Heard this way, this way. See there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Rickard. I feel like Rickard did it. The graves of the band of the hawks. Yeah. Yeah, he didn't even... Yeah, he was so focused on getting his revenge. Man. Why are these their graves? It's nowhere near... <laughs> Man, this is breaking my heart. It's nowhere near the right number, but I made them as practice. And, yeah. I feel like... What the old man saying is true. Guts is trying to um, to escape the sorrow by focusing towards anger. Because yeah, if it's like he he's he he wouldn't be able to 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 take it head on. He's going, and he need at the same time he also needed something to make to push him a will to uh, uh, like something to make him strive to live but at the same time he had Casca so what the old man was really saying was really yeah it's definitely the truth and he even had Rickert at the same time I didn't know that at first so I thought he was I thought that the reason why he was out alone get alone getting revenge is because I thought everyone died because that's the only reason that that would that's the only thing that would make sense is that he's the only survivor Casca died because 
well, if I knew that Casca was still, I guess uh, now I know. Um, and after that, I was so worried. Though I, why did he have to leave? Especially, she's also branded. She's, she's um, her mind is co- in a complete mess. She's not, she's not herself. So she's so vo- vo- she's the most vulnerable among them. And yet he left. <laughs> so that's what really somewhat worried me a lot. And I guess now he's he's definitely realizing it again. Same thing that happened when he left um, Griffith. Because that he left the band of the Hawks. It's nowhere near the right number, but I made them as fact. So it's not like nobody's underneath here, but some consolation. But at the same time, he's the only one. Who saw what happened? Um, it's it's I guess it's different. It's different to to say or just be able to make a wise decision if you haven't been a if you haven't been in that situation where guts were in. Cause yeah, still really hard, especially after what he saw and after yeah, after what Griffith did. So it definitely was a struggle towards what he should focus on and yeah his anger was so overwhelmingly his emotions towards revenge and his towards Griffith was so much stronger that he even left Casca I guess he at the same time he felt secured he felt somewhat confident that uh, yeah the Casca was safe here Especially after learning about the that um the the apostle or something or the spirits the demons cannot go here. But one of the apostles did come here. So but yeah. Two years plenty of time for a person to change in that in the time I've gone on hating Rickert. Rickert's done this. Yeah. Funerals to accept the death of his comrades. He found a new way to live through that vigorous strength of his. Still, though, I'm amazed that the boy from back then would turn out to be God's friend. What a shocker! Oh yeah, this is the first time. Oh, <laughs> I just yeah, this is this is their first time seeing each other again. Yeah, really, thanks to you, both God's and Casca narrowly escaped dying death. I have you thank for that. Oh now, now at least, Buck will also know. I guess he wouldn't. She he wouldn't because it's only God who um saw what happened. At the same time, at least this will give Buck a more general of idea of what happened or lies within the cause of the current or something like that. I guess it's like we're all tied together by a red thread of destiny. Me too. Me too. No, not red. <laughs> by the way, you've been cured. I, uh, uh, your. F- by the way, you've been cured. Uh, your fear uh, elves yet? Ah, uh, no, not yet. What? What does this mean? You've been cured by. Oh, uh, you. You've been cured by uh, elves. Elf as well. So maybe that's what she's talking about. Then later on, I'll stake my life on treating you. Ah, uh, no, don't bother. It's the same as it was. There's definitely somewhere else lived. No evil spirits are gonna be able to sneak in here easily. Yeah, I know that you're anxious, but rest well tonight. There's a lot, a lot to talk about, but for now we'll hurry and repair your sword in hand. They look pretty abused, so we'll get them to where you can and sh- head out soon. Rickert. Huh, what about me? You'll be cuddling with me. <laughs> about earlier. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. No, no. I'm the one who's sorry. I got impatient. I got impatient too. But these two years being here, I've. Hey, what am I? A babysitter? You've got a problem. <laughs> Realize something important things. Alright then. Good night. See you again in fate. If fate decreases. Good night. It's no use. Even though, though I'm, I know I'm safe. There's no way I can sleep in the dark without the sword. No chance. No, chances are I won't be able to sleep at the night the rest of my life.
Yeah. Imagine how lonely she was at the, as as well. But yeah, I guess I guess because Casca also somewhat hated Guts at the same time. She was somewhat scared of him. You went alone. You were right beside those in resp- a in play. I mean, he's now realizing it. Replaceable things, yet you couldn't bear to immerse yourself together in sorrow with them. So instead, you ran away so that your own malice could burn within you. Man, <laughs> that was damn. Yeah, but at the same time, he cannot forgive. He cannot. He doesn't want to let those apostles, Griffith, to get away w- with what they did. To Casca, to the band of the Hawks. Yeah. Yeah. Because I didn't run away. I can't run. Not from the last thing seared into my right eye. Fear, malice, I don't know. Possibly it's both. I can never atone for this dark flame. If I can't atone, if I can't as- escape, all I can do is burn myself and my enemies with it. Oh. It's the, the hound or something. The blood must flow, so keep killing. It will still thirst forever, all alone, always. Maybe what God has said is right, though. What? can I say now when I left her in a state like that I've got no right talking about revenge from her comrades when I abandoned Casca abandoned the band of the hawk itself you mean former raider cap- raiders captain I won't recognize it I don't know if it was for some dream or what but he left on his own he wasn't here when things were at the worst for us I think I can call someone like that a comrade. You've re- you've already separated yourself. There's no obligation for you to go that far. Take her with you. Oh. Yeah. This is I think yeah, this is I think right after their fight with with Wild. Damn. Take her with you even if you have to drag her this time if you don't she you fight your own battles right you have to go even if it's alone <laughs> ah, man this 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 hurts you have to go that's right don't I go yeah he's realizing it now he's he's he done he has done the same mistake twice now I just hope that Casca won't die this time around. I hope it's not too late, man. What was that vision or dream that he saw? I guess it's a, it's a warning, so maybe at least he could still save her. Long ago, ever since then, I haven't had that right. I started this war myself. It's definitely different from what I wish I had before then. But at least it's not like anyone forced me to do it. I declare this war on myself, but still, yeah, man. He had that. What's burning me ain't just this black flame. The campfire from those days still burns in my chest. That's right. Wasn't this last feeble flame left to me? All that barely kept me from being consumed by the black flame. What I've done, did I again, did I go and do it again? You mean, did I lose something before I even noticed it again? Again, without even knowing, without even realizing, I've thrown it from the palm of my hand. When the sky falls at the holy ground, blind sheep gather, erect a pillar of fire, no. Not yet. The flame, it's not yet blown out. Not yet. It's not too late. This time, I swear, I'll never lose her again. Damn. Man, I think this is one of the best chapters I've read so far. I think one one of my favorites. The internal struggle of guts. 
damn that was <laughs> man that was sick then that was brutal with what uh god said to guts i think guts needed to hear that because it, yeah it's true he did he did he did made the same mistake twice twice now Man, that was <laughs> that last chapter was really emotional because yeah, go because you remember the time he had with the band of the hawks. It was like his his only precious moments. Yet he still abandoned it. He left. He left. I guess it, it seems like he keeps on going towards towards destruction and. Whenever he gets this small amount of happiness, I guess he's not used to it. As <laughs> man, I, I remember that moment when, um, when, uh, when he had that conversation with Jado. And he even had also that. Yeah, I think um, even before he left the Hawk, um, Judo also told Guts to bring Casca along with him. So, yeah. <laughs> Man, this is some good chapters. It's, it's, it's more like internal struggle. The same, I guess the first three or four chapters I we've read today is more like I guess going back going back to midland to the to the to windham to what's currently happening now with the princess and i guess the state of the of the people and that hawk definitely uh I f it, it, it really feels like griffith doing his thing um through those dreams so maybe that's his power now and at the same time, it also somewhat like when Nosferatu was in that dream, it's like, um, it's, it's like in the middle. It's like a reality and a dream at the same time. So, yeah, Griffith now is working his magic. Um, so I guess he still has that um, desire to, and also they also talked about the desired. So it feels like more like a name. Rather than like um, an an action or, ver or something like that, something. So the desired might be Griffith. Maybe, maybe he might be the representation of that. Maybe he's coming back in human form. I think he could do that if he wanted to, and take over uh, Midland or Windham. And especially that vision that, um, was it La, La, Laban or Labo? I forget his name. General, yeah, I think it was Labo or something. That, um, yeah, that dream. I guess it's not just him, all of the people within Midham, Windham, which is somewhat suspicious. Seems like he's trying to earn his reputation. Especially if he comes back, Charlotte will definitely Yeah, want him again. She she she's so in love with him. But yeah, it's I guess we'll see, man. But but definitely interesting. If he's if he still has that desire, ambition. Um But yeah. If he has that, he also has to worry about guts, cause yeah, guts definitely after him. But yeah, I, I I hope that he still finds Casca, and also that his son. Uh, this was re that's really cool that it it somewhat warned, but it's been a month. I guess it's been a month of travel from where guts currently were to going back to the mountains with Godo so that's why and man Rickert is he's, I guess it's been two years so yeah Guts needs Guts still needs to 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 
um, at least hopefully he could protect especially I guess he could le- he could he could they could still it's much safer for them to be here than with guts at the same time so yeah I guess guts just need to I don't know what guts will do now but man I, but I'm worried because <laughs> at the state of the story right now if he finds Casca is it going to stay but it wouldn't fit the his journey towards fighting Griffith so I I'm I'm somewhat worried that they might kill off Casca here so that he has nothing else left to do it's like he, he doesn't have anything else now once that happens and man I'm scared <laughs> I'm scared for guts cuz I feel like when that happens that's like he's he's now at breaking point and once that happens he's he's already it's already too late for him to go back he, he's he's going past to that cuz yeah that that I think that representation with the dark flame and like a light flame is like a two sides of of the coin of his current like personality now because one is the the anger the 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 vicious the the dark side of him try hoping to kill and destroy all the apostles and Griffith and the other side is um, protecting or yeah treasuring the only people left now in his life so man that was really cool <laughs> and I- I'm really worried for Casca cause I don't think it's going to stop God's killing the apostles and hunting Griffith but one other possibility hopeful <laughs> thing I could think of he rescued Casca Casca came back into his right mind she she won't be mentally stable anymore and she works with Griffith now I mean with Guts now because she's also a great um, warrior she's also really skilled she could be potentially like his assistant but I don't think at the same time I don't think Guts would want that because she would still be in danger because these apostles they're they're so strong but yeah because she's another problem is if she comes along with guts she's also branded so i wonder if that will amplify the number of spirits or i guess the apostles that may come i guess it's only the spirits it's not really the apostles but at the same time this is there to protect her and he's he's strong enough i think to be able to do so so and if she's she she comes back to her right mind i think she could also become she could also train herself again so that's a possibility but who knows what will happen in the next few chapters and that vision that it's not griffith who gave gave him that dream it was his son so it's it feels like it's it's like a vision of the future so or yeah maybe something like that so yeah that's pretty much it what i think in this uh chapters let me know what you think about it and if you did enjoy watching my read through please leave a like and make sure to subscribe for updates and if you want to watch my read throughs on the next chapters just check out the link in the description down below in my patreon and also shout out to my patrons for supporting this channel and uh, yeah, thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Have a great day. Goodbye.